Hi guys, it's me again. You might be wondering why I'm wearing a sock on one hand. Um, it's not because it's cold down here, although it is a little bit nippy. Um, it's because I'm cleaning up this airplane, making it look nice um, for Joan All, which is the big event I'm going to. And that often happens, you know, when you go to a big event, you kind of want your airplane to look really nice in the sun. And there's a couple of little tips that I've kind of gathered through scouring the internet and talking to friends on some of the common things that happen with blemishes and things on airplanes and quick things you can do. I mean, super quick, couple of minute things you can do to sort of make this plane almost look like factory new again. Um, so one of the really common things that can happen is wrinkling, especially on giant scale. This can happen along the turtle deck, as you can see here. You can see like these little wrinkles here. And so um, there's a super easy way to get rid of these. What I've, there's different uh, techniques, but what I've found that is the quickest and works really good is you just take a, a hobby knife here, a little hobby knife, and then you go through and you just poke maybe one or two holes in this bubbled area. Cause there's, it's actually like an air pocket in there, right? And so you want uh, the air to like escape kind of. Um, so don't go too crazy on the holes. Just put, poke like one hole in the center or maybe two holes depending on the size of the wrinkle. And then what you do is you take a, you take a heat iron, so I got one right here, or a, a heat gun actually, I'm sorry, a heat gun. And you kind of gently turn it on, gently go over the spot, just a few, few times turning it off if it's getting too hot. Um, I like to put my sock in front of it just to feel the heat, get a sense of how hot it is, because you can burn the covering, you don't want to do that. Um, you, you probably won't, I mean, I have never burnt the covering myself, like, I think you'd have to, like, s stick it on there for a while in order to do that, but, um, and I can't do this while also filming, so let's just pretend that I'm doing this, but at the same time, what I do is I will take my sock hand, and I will just go over and just rub over this without really applying any pressure, just, just almost barely a little bit of pressure, and all of a sudden that wrinkle will just go away. Um, and if you look on the other side, I've done that. Um, so just kind of spinning around here. Um, so on the other side here on this turtle deck, you can see that it's much smoother. If I can maybe get the reflection on here, yeah. It's uh, it's pretty smooth. There's still a couple of little imperfections, but it's pretty darn smooth. Um, so I did it on this side. I'm just uh, working on the other side right now. Um, the other thing that really helps, and I have to say thanks to uh, Terry Wiles from Terry Customs on this one, is using this product called Lucas Oil Slick Mist. Um, and so basically after you kind of get the airplane wiped down, just using just regular Windex or something, just to get the dirt and you know smoke oil and stuff out, um, I take a nice clean shop towel, uh, spray a little bit of this stuff on, and then it's it's basically a, like like a uh, here's the logo, Lucas uh, Slick Mist Speed Wax. What this product is called? I got it from Amazon, but basically it is a wax. And so, you know, I try to kind of work it like this, um, and then just be sure not to go like these pointy bits here. You don't want to move this this way because you could actually peel up that pointy bit. So just just be careful not to uh, ruin your covering, um, and just kind of very gently uh, apply this stuff on and it will create this really nice shiny, I don't know if it's coming across in the video, but this side is actually done. I have, again, I have to do the other side, but it creates a really nice shine. I can never get it as good as Terry uh, and his planes just look so good all the time. So, I mean, you know, I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna dream about getting close to that, but hey, uh, you can, you can only tr try, right? Um, so, I know we're all pretty strapped for time and we wanna go flying, but these are pretty quick little uh, things you can do, a couple of minutes just to, uh, just to, uh, yeah, get your planes to look nice. I hope this was useful. See you again.